awakening is running health recoveries 100% cure for depression insomnia asthma fatigue chronic pain insecurity panic attacks and other major disorders awaken the kundalini shakti the dormant energy within what would you do if you had 1300% more energy disease free mind and body is your first wealth claim it at inner awakening inner awakening a 21 day meditation retreat with rare living incarnation paramahamsa nityananda nityananda dhyana pita nityananda nagar biridi bengaluru karnataka contact 0802727 Double nine, double nine. Email i a at nityananda dot o r g. Nityananda Shwara Samarambha. Nityananda Shwari Madhyama. अस्मदाचार्यपर्यंतां वंदे गुरुपरंपरां इस समय हमारे साथ उपस्थित सभी दर्शकों और भक्तों का मैं प्रेम एवं आशीर्वाद सहित स्वागत करता हूं आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू with my love and blessings first thing today i wanted to share with you all from today we start the new season abhyayana ruthu the season of enriching yesterday it started today it starts full fledged for our sangha from today starts the new season till navaratri abhyayana ruthu means by enriching having completion and spiritual explosion please listen please come to the space of listening every conversation you have infuses certain energy in you if you continuously have conversations about the share sari jewelry you will see automatically that kind of energy is infused in you please listen if you continuously talk have conversation about the temples kshetras tirthas the desire to experience them is infused in you whatever conversations you continuously have that kind of a interest curiosity energy inspiration is infused in you so the conversation you have is very important because you are not only conversing with others you are conversing with yourself also when you are talking you have to be very clear you are also listening which we forget we always think we are intelligent enough to protect ourselves from our own words we think eh, 
ఐ నో వాట్ ఎవర్ ఐఎమ్ అట్రింగ్ ఇస్ లిటిల్ 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 ట్రూత్ అండ్ లిటిల్ దిట్స్ దిస్ వే దట్ వే ఓకే ఓకే బట్ ఫర్ అదర్స్ ఐ లాటర్ ఐ విల్ నాట్ బిలీవ్ ఇన్ సైడ్ ట్రై ఐఎమ్ టెలింగ్ యూ ట్రై జస్ట్ ట్రై ఫర్ టెన్ డేస్ ఫర్ టెన్ డేస్ జస్ట్ ట్రై గో రౌండ్ కంటిన్యూస్లీ టాకింగ్ పాజిటివ్ థింగ్స్ ఎస్ there is a existence of ultimate intelligence god i am progressing towards it i can see right things happening talk 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 10 things about this 10 days and see what happens to your inner space and then take next 10 days go around and say i think i am depressed there is no god there is no guru nothing everything is useless this are all just bogus be like atheist typical tamil nadu atheist and see what happens try then you will understand the power of the conversations you have the power of the words you utter how much they influence you how strongly either they inspire you or terrorize you how strongly they move you how strongly they impact you understand you are nothing but the words you utter you are nothing but the words you listen you are nothing but the words you echo inside please listen you are totality of the words you hear words you echo and words you utter the words you hear the words you echo means the words you cognize sometime for example if you hear about love immediately you cognize that is very difficult for me the words you hear the words you cognize and the words you utter play some major role in your life totality of all these three is your life all this put together is your life the conversations you have with yourself and others are very important the conversations you have the conversations in which you actively participate is very important sometime one active conversation one right conversation can just completely transform your life same way one conversation can destroy your life so from today let us all take a very strong decision with integrity we will have only enriching conversation this whole season which enriches us and others with integrity authenticity responsibility and completion till october 13th navaratri till vijayadashami
till Vijayadashmi. We will decide with integrity and authenticity. We will take the responsibility of enriching ourselves and others. You need to know if you are enriching with a vested interest you will give up on people. Don't have any vested interest. Enrich just for the sake of enriching. Enrich just as a being of enriching. Listen. Enrich just for the sake of enriching. Enrich just as the being of enriching. I tell you, enrich just for the excitement you feel while enriching. Enriching brings so much of excitement inside you, outside you. Aaj se hum apyaya narutu ka aram kar rahe hai. Iska arth hai laban vit karne dwara purnatva aur adhyatmik vikas pana. Jo bhi varta lab aap karte hai, us prakar ki urja aap mein bar jati hai. यदि आप लगातार देवस्थान तीर्थ क्षेत्रों के बारे में वार्तालाप करते हैं तो उस विषय में आपकी रुचि बढ़ती है आप स्वयं देख सकते हैं दस दिन सकारात्मक विचार और बात कीजिए कि मैं जीवन में विकास कर रहा हूं अगले दस दिन नकारात्मक विचार और बात कीजिए कि मैं दुखी हूं भगवान नहीं है इत्यादि आप देखेंगे कि आपके शब्द कितनी शक्तिशाली है और वास्तविकता में परिवर्तित होते हैं आप, आपके शब्द आपको प्रेरित या भाईबीत करते हैं आपको प्रभावित करते हैं आप और कुछ नहीं बल्कि आपके शब्द है जो आप दूसरों से कहते हैं सुनते हैं और स्वयं को बोलते हैं जिन वार्तालाप में आप भाग लेते हैं वो बहुत ही महत्वपूर्ण है केवल एक वार्तालाप आपके जीवन को परिवर्तित कर सकता है या आपका विनाश कर सकता है इसीलिए आइए हम ये दृढ़ शब, शब्द ले संपूर्ति और श्रद्धा के साथ विजयदशमी तक हम सब केवल लाभान्वित करने वाले वार्तालाप ही करेंगे हम स्वयं और दूसरों को लाभान्वित करेंगे दूसरों को लाभान्वित यू ही कीजिए बिना किसी निजी कारण के क्योंकि आपका स्वभाव ही लाभान्वित करना है केवल उस उत्साह के लिए जो लाभान्वित करना लाता है One of the biggest disease Hinduism is suffering is selfishness. Hinduism has all the great values, vast ocean of spiritual knowledge, mystical strength, just the one disease, non-enriching attitude. selfishness and the ideas which got developed supporting this selfishness 
that's the biggest cancer with which hinduism is suffering suffered i can say the cancer is almost killed hinduism if we have to save the oldest greatest spiritual tradition of the planet earth we need a strong powerful chemotherapy and surgery remove all the selfish ideas remove all the ideas self centered through surgery throw all the ideas out and infuse the great truths of enriching infuse the great truths of enriching infuse the great truth of enriching we have a very wrong idea first let me experience then i'll enrich it is like first let me get cured then i will take medicine understand enriching 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 is the cure enriching is experience enriching is tapas it is enriching which unclutches you from your past incompletions it is enriching which distances you from your past incompletions it is enriching which creates gap between you and your past incompletions it is enriching which makes you grow a child if a child tries to unclutch from a toy car he will be struggling 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 but if he just grows the toy will automatically drop him enriching makes you just grow having this enriching conversation makes you just grow to the next level of you enriching makes automatically many of your incompletions to drop you please understand if you are completing trying to unclutch drop your incompletions you are struggling with your incompletions and patterns if you are enriching your incompletions will drop you you only have to decide whether you should be struggling with your 
సిగరెట్ అన్ ఆల్కహాల్ ఆర్ యువర్ ఆల్కహాల్ అండ్ సిగరెట్ షుడ్ డ్రాప్ యూ అండ్ గో ఎవే ఎన్రిచింగ్ ఈస్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద బెస్ట్ మోస్ట్ పవర్ఫుల్ స్పిరిచువల్ ప్రాసెస్ అండ్ స్పిరిచువల్ టెక్నిక్ ఐ నో ఫర్ ష్యూర్ హిందూస్ ఆర్ నెవర్ గోయింగ్ టు బిలీవ్ బికాస్ it is not there in their bio energy the only difference between buddhism and hinduism why buddhism is still a living stream of enlightened masters hinduism is not is this great sacred truth of enriching in the hinduism the anti enriching concepts are very prevalent don't teach others unless they are qualified secret secret don't teach others they are of different community in the name of community caste we have hidden the knowledge from others without enriching finally we ourselves forgot how to enrich ourselves and destroyed it that is exactly the way the whole vedic tradition was destroyed first thing the hindus need to learn is enriching 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 let enriching be our religion let enriching be our lifestyle sometimes i am surprised shocked by the power of enriching just by enriching people become saints sages because when you enrich naturally you go through the conversations of sacrifice dedication devotion again and again some of the best words are uttered by you and cognized by your brain which is equivalent to practicing all those great truths again and again whether you spend 10 crore rupee on do some charitable work are go on talking inspiring others to do charitable work your brain cognizes charity sacrifice spending 10 crore rupee and doing a charity what is the exact final result which is required for you you are brain cognizing sacrifice your brain cognizing tyaga basavanna very beautifully says the veerashiva lingayat sampradaya of karnataka the thread which is kept with certain color absorbs the thread absorbs that color the brain which is kept with certain words absorbs that words if a thread is kept with certain color a white thread is kept with red color what will happen to the white thread it will become red if your brain is left with the words charity sacrifice dedication devotion integrity authenticity again and again it will just absorb that words end of the day the result required is 
those great truths are absorbed by your brain so spending 10 crore and doing a charity what is the end result your brain getting developed by absorbing the great words like dedication sacrifice integrity authenticity same thing will simply happen in you when you enrich others with these great words the same result exactly happens the power of enriching continuously inspires you i tell you only if you continue to enrich without giving up on others you won't give up on you hindu dharm एक बहुत बड़े रोग से पीड़ित है और वो है स्वार्थ यही सबसे बड़ा कैंसर है जिसे हिंदू धर्म पीड़िता और अभी भी पीड़ित है हिंदू धर्म को एक शक्तिशाली कीमोथेरेपी का थेरेपी की आवश्यकता है और वो है लाभान्वित करने का महान सत्य हम एक बहुत गलत विचार रखते हैं कि पहले में स्वयं अनुभव करे करने के बाद दूसरों से बात सकता हूं ये ऐसे है जैसे आपके रहे हैं कि पहले में रोग से टी को जाऊंगा और फिर दवाई लूंगा लाभान्वित करना ही आप और आपके अतीत की अपूर्णताओं के बीच अंदर लाता है आपका सीधे विकास करता है लाभान्वित करने वाले वार्तालाप आपको अगले स्तर पर ले जाते हैं लाभान्वित करना आपकी कई अपूर्णताओं को मिटा देता है यदि आप अपनी अपूर्णताओं और पैटर्न्स के साथ संस्कारा के साथ जूझ रहे हैं लाभान्वित कीजिए और आप देखेंगे कि आपकी अपूर्णताएं और पैटर्न्स आपको छोड़ देंगे क्यों हिंदी धर्म को हिंदू धर्म बौद्ध धर्म की तरह जीवित नहीं है केवल इसी कारण ही हिंदू धर्म में लाभान्वित करने के महान सत्य को हमने नहीं माना पहले बात जो हिंदू लोगों को सीखना चाहिए वो है लाभान्वित करना लाभान्वित करना हमारा धर्म होना चाहिए हमारी जीवन शैली होनी चाहिए इट इज एनरिचिंग 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 वी नीड टू एड टू हिंदुइज्म हिंदुइज्म एज एवरीथिंग एल्स Nothing else need to be added to Hinduism. Just enriching. Laban with karna itna shakti shali hai ki keval usi ke dwara log mahan sant ban gaye hai kyunki aapka dimag tyag samarpan ka sagyan karta hai Basavanna ji ne bahut sundar roop se kaha hai yadi ek दागा को किसी रंग में रखा जाता है वो दागा उस रंग को सोख लेता है उसी तरह आपका दिमाग जिन शब्दों में विलीन होता है उन्हें सोख लेता है और उनका अनुभव करता है लाभान्वित करना आपको लगातार प्रेरित करता है केवल जब आप लगातार दूसरों को लाभान्वित करते हैं आप स्वयं को भी बिना आत्मविश्वास को ये स्वयं को भी लाभान्वित करेंगे
please understand only by bringing enriching we are going to keep the hinduism alive because it is already suffering the fourth stage cancer of selfishness we need a powerful surgery and powerful chemo chemotherapy hindu tradition can be saved only by bringing enriching as our lifestyle otherwise our books religious knowledge religious literatures everything will be just useless a man was complaining to station master in an indian railway station sir what is the use of having a train schedule if the trains are always late the station master replied how would we know they are late if we did not have a schedule the indian train station schedule train schedule is useful only to find how much time the train is late only for the purpose of post mortem it is useful we may laugh but see the reality it is like a, having a huge medical science just to know the cause of death after a person dies only for post mortem we have a huge medical library hospital 10000 doctors and 1 lakh bed hospital machineries chemicals medicines everything why after a person dies we will diagnose very precisely what all the causes of his death that is exactly where we hindus are standing we can diagnose the reason for failure the ability to diagnose the reason for failure is not going to keep us alive o hindus o hindus who are soaked in the pride of thinking you are a sanatana dharma you are a eternal religion nobody can destroy you wake up maybe nobody can destroy you but you can be shrunk which is already happening to you you can be controlled you can be contained you can be restricted which is already happening to you wake up from the pseudo pride wake up from the pseudo pride that nothing can shake you हिंदू धर्म में सब कुछ है केवल ये लाभान्वित करने के लक्षण की कमी है केवल इस लाभान्वित करने की तत्व से ही हिंदू धर्म की हम रक्षा कर सकते हैं वरना हिंदू धर्म के सिद्धांत पूरे निरुपयोग 
हो जाएंगे इन यूएस वी हैव बिल्ट 900 हिंदू टेंपल्स व्हिच इज मोर देन 2 बिलियन डॉलर वैल्यू बट नॉट इवन वन हिंदू चेयर इज हेल्ड by a person who is born and brought up as a hindu in single university of us then understand yes you build temples no doubt but what the mainstream society is being taught about you still americans learn about hinduism from many universities as we people ride on the elephants and jump from one tree to another tree and throw the children kids to the crocodiles or throw ourselves on the jagannath chariot or weird large size sexual orgies and women are burnt left and right with husband's fire this is what is still taught why because we are too busy we are too busy in keeping our knowledge secret ye samjhe keval swayam aur dusro ko labanvit aur samriddhi karne se hum hindu dharm ko jeevit rakh payenge kyunki hindu dharm हमारा हिंदू धर्म स्वार्थ नामक चौथे स्टेज कैंसर से पीड़ित है केवल लाभान्वित करने की जीवन शैली से ही हिंदू धर्म को बचाया जा सकता है और हिंदू विनाश के बाद समस्या का कारण खोजना का कोई उपयोग नहीं है इस झूठे गर्व से जागिए कि आपको कुछ भी हिला नहीं सकता है क्यों कि सनातन धर्म अनंत है अंडरस्टैंड सनातन धर्म वास एटर्नल यस विदाउट इवन ए सेट ऑफ रूल्स आर वन बुक वन डेटी वन प्रिंसिपल वी ऑल सर्वाइव्ड because the whole atmosphere the air was filled with dhamma dharma either you pick up shiva or devi or vishnu or muruga or krishna but the air ambiance or such you will pick up any one but first time the ozone layer started having holes just like ozone layer covering the planet earth the atmosphere of dhamma dharma was covering our country our minds not any more the media revolution has already made holes in the ozone layers the amount of abusal attack we have to go through a persistent continuous untiring attack by the media houses which are funded by vested interests you can be alive you can survive only by enriching
I tell you, take up enriching as a lifestyle that only is going to awaken you i am teaching enriching not even in the context of other in the context of you because hindus can be moved only anything is start in the context of them me what is there for me i'll continue on this truth of enriching aaj ki satsang ka saransh hai ab hum keval labanvit karne se hi jeevit reh sakte hai labanvit karne ko apni jeevan shaili banaiye वही आपको जागृत कर सकता है आई ऑल्सो हैव अनाउंसमेंट टुडे फ्रॉम टुडे अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रियलिटी शो फर्स्ट टाइम इवर एवर इन द वर्ल्ड होस्टेड बाय मी नित्य धर्मम विल बी यार in tandi tv one of the tamil channels from tonight 9 pm indian standard time the tv is also viewable viewable online www.tanditv.com ulagam muluvadum ippozh satsangathai paarthukondirukkum tamil anbargalukku oru inimaiyana seidhi இன்று முதல் தந்தி தொலைக்காட்சியில் தந்தி டிவியில் இரவு ஒன்பது மணி முதல் பத்து மணி வரை ஒவ்வொரு சனிக்கிழமையும் நித்திய தர்மம் எனும் ரியாலிட்டி ஷோ மக்களுடைய மனம் உணர்வு உணர்ச்சிகள் சார்ந்த பிரச்சனைக்கு தீர்வு அனைவரும் கண்டு ஞானமும் ஆனந்தமும் அடையலாம் ஐல் மூட் தி நெக்ஸ்ட் செக்மெண்ட் ஆஃப் த மார்னிங் சத்சங் நிராகார சமயமா டுமாரோ த நிராகார சமயமா செகண்ட் லெவல் வில் ஹாவ் அ பிரேக் யூ கேன் ஈட் த்ரீ டைம்ஸ் டுமாரோ and day after tomorrow we will start the level 3 which will go on for 11 11 days ab hum nitya satsang ke agle bhag nirahar samyama mein pravesh karenge sidhi tarah se baith jaiye aur chetna sthiti ke sath kalpana kijiye ki aap bidti vadavriksh ban gaye hai is kalpana ke sath aap apne dono nasikao aur muh ke dwara saans andar lijiye jitni der saans ko aap apne andar बांध कर रख सकते हैं उतनी देर आप अपने अंदर सांस को बांध कर रखिए जब आप सांस को और बांध कर नहीं रख पा रहे हैं तब आप अपने मुंह बांध रखे हैं रख के सांस को अपनी दोनों नासिकाओं द्वारा धीरे से छोड़ दीजिए आप में अपनी पूरे संपूर्ति श्रद्धा उत्तरदायित्व और लाभान्वित करने के चार तत्वों के साथ आशीर्वाद देता हूँ कि आप सबकी कुंडलिनी शक्ति जागृत हो जाए और आप सब अपनी जीव ऊर्जा को सीधे आकाश और वायु से उत्पन्न करें अब क्रिया आरंभ कीजिए और इस क्रिया को लगातार 21 मिनट तक कीजिए 
all the nirahara samyama participants sit straight close your eyes visualize cognize you have become vidhi kalpa vriksha and inhale through both the nostrils and the mouth as deeply as possible hold as long as you can exhale slowly through both the nostrils do this for next 21 minutes i bless you all with my integrity authenticity responsibility and enriching let you all experience health bliss and enlightenment by producing the energy directly from the space namah shivaya inner awakening is running health recoveries 100% cure for depression insomnia asthma fatigue chronic pain insecurity panic attacks and other major disorders awaken the kundalini shakti the dormant energy within what would you do if you had 1300% more energy disease free mind and body is your first wealth claim it at inner awakening inner awakening a 21 day meditation retreat with rare living incarnation paramahamsa nityananda nityananda dhyana peeta nityananda nagar biridi bengaluru karnataka contact 08027279999 email ia@nityananda.org let you all achieve experience live express radiate share and explode in eternal bliss nityananda nityananda dhyana peetam nityananda nagar of mysore road bidadi bengaluru phone 0802727999 www.nityananda.org www.youtube.com/lifeblissfoundation